February 1st started off to be a very normal day. And by around 11 o'clock, I had upwards to around 20 people inside of the bar. We saw the front door open. We looked to see who it was, and there was an individual coming in dressed mostly in black. He had asked me, is this the gay bar? And there was some writings in his notebook uh, about his dislike for homosexuals and gays. And uh, there was some pictures and writings that had some violent undertones to them. I've only been out in the community for maybe four to six weeks. And now I'm lying in a pool of blood, and I think I'm going to die. He was a good kid as far as every time I hung out with him, always had a smile on his face, always happy. Yeah, I turned on the news, and there's my friend on the news, and it was a little crazy. And as it turns out, there were actually three men shot in that bar. Two of them were also hit with that hatchet. They're all in serious condition in Boston right now in Rabita. Now, this 18-year-old kid, he is still... They believe Rabita used the hatchet because this symbol is linked to a group they identify with called Juggalos. Get to the hospital. I got broken bones in my face. The pain is tremendous. The state police detectives came in. They said, believe us, we're putting a lot of people on this case. We're looking at this as a hate crime. And that was the first I heard of a hate crime. No one will ever really know why a young man chose to vent his hatred and rage inside of a gay bar. I'm a teacher at New Bedford High School. The words faggot, queer, dyke are so fluent at New Bedford High School, if you rid up every kid that used one of those words, you'd have no kids in school. I was thinking about what would happen if he ever showed up in my house. I would run up to him and hug him like so hard because I knew I probably would never see him again. And then I'd probably, like, just tell him how stupid it was what he did. So this was in Jake's room. A simple word is gay or fag hurt somebody else, just like the word nigga used to hurt me. So we have to stop this hatred and start working together.